I was just thinking this morning before you came about the number of, of uh, real upheavals in the church that we've forgotten about. There was the whole question of the remarriage of divorced people. The church was very strict about that. Well, now everybody does it. There was the whole thing about the ordination of women. I got very much involved in that because Ted Scott and I were very close to each other and we were working in tandem on that. And you would have thought the world was coming to an end because we decided that we were ordained women and there could even be women bishops. And a lot of people were very, very upset and in some congregations they left, people left the church. Then there was the whole, before that, there was the whole problem about the new prayer book, the book of alternative services. People were horrified. They said, uh, it's not right, it's not, it's not Anglican, it's not, it's not what we expected. And they would come to church and say, which service are we having, this, the prayer book or that one? And if we said that one, they would go home again. So, um, the older you get, the longer you have experienced the church, the more you're inclined to say, uh-huh, we've been here before, and we've been here for thousands of years, and we're still going to be here.